Hi, I'm Ed Del Grande, and today we're talking about generator options for your home. Basically, it gets down to two choices, standby generators and portable generators. Standby generators are permanently installed and they turn themselves on and off automatically. A portable generator can be moved from location to location, but when you use them, you can only power up a few appliances and you will have to run extension cords to those appliances. There are also other concerns to keep in mind when using portable generators. Now let me show you some of the safety features you have to keep in mind if you do use a portable generator. First of all, the sizes usually range from three to eight kilowatts, so that will power some major appliances, but it won't power an entire house. Speaking of the house, never use a portable generator inside a house or a garage. It has to go outside in a dry, well-ventilated area and no closer than 15 feet to any windows. Now you will have to run power cords through those windows and here are the outlets and remember the power cords have to be heavy duty and properly grounded and never run a cord from the generator into an outlet of the house. You don't plug it in. You run your cords directly to the appliances you want to power up. Also back here is the fuel tank because they do run on gasoline so that means every six to eight hours you have to fill it up. When you fill it up make sure that you shut it off let it cool down because you are working with gasoline and you don't want to start any fires or create a dangerous situation and always store the fuel safely those are the safety tips to keep in mind with portable generators